However, this opportunity was offered to me and I see it as an opportunity to use my privileged position to undermine the system that will put me there. The best thing I can do is hire people who aren't white, cisgender, heterosexual men, make them equal owners. Oh my God. And follow their lead in making the place less white male centered than the industry standard. That's what I'm working towards and I expect to be held accountable if I don't get there. Well... And he also has as a, not a question, oh, another business owned by a rich white guy. Oh, wait a second. Let me go to the last one. But how can you be anti-capitalist if you sell things? LOL. Let's see the rich white, with rich white guy uh, answer. Well, not a question. This is criticism. This criticism is at least partially a valid reaction to the imperfect media coverage I've received so far. It would have, it would be one of my first reactions if I heard about the business. However, the first thing I had uh, to, uh, I would do about the reaction which doesn't seem to have crossed some people's minds would be to ask the questions or a question or visit the place to make up my own mind. I'm definitely not rich. I come from a working class background, although my dad eventually selling <laughs> oh my god, eventually selling his soul to teach at a private school did give me some middle class privilege. KR, it's like they want to stay down, man. <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? I understand. I understand exactly what you're trying to say. People usually try to stay down to build up. It's... <laughs> <laughs> but he's trying to get back down. So the dad worked from public to private school, prob probably, to, to, to give his son... Uh, um, a, a better life and he's trying to get back now he's doing a pretty good job of that so i have to give him that but what are we talking about have been a server my entire adult life and even my highest paying job didn't pay a living wage i'm a white cisgender queer man when I used stop, to stop, date, stop. we continue. When I used to daydream about opening my own cafe, the idea was always left the bad taste in my mouth because I also <laughs> feel that the world doesn't need more things owned by people at my particular intersection of privileges. What? Listen, KR. What that's that's the whole problem. What, it doesn't matter what age you are, what sex you are, what you identify as. Business, uh, what, no one, we talked about this in a previous show. No one, no one, we talked about it in the on the science show. You can share things with people, but sometimes you need, people will one express. Thing at the time. Yo, yeah, hold, yeah. Hold on. You're, getting, you're getting too excited. Yeah, yeah. But you need to let me, let me, oh, yeah. So let me just. Give me the space. Okay. You want to, you want to, you want to, um, yeah, yeah. You want to s do business. Your mm -hmm. whole business is coffee. This person has clear, clearly has some mental uh, health issues that he needs to solve. <laughs> this is not a joke. I'm serious. Why do I say that? His answers are all defensive. It's clear that he's, he, he has a low self-esteem. Why? It doesn't matter. I mean, it doesn't matter what in business. So I'm talking in business, not personally, but in business. It, no one cares about you. They might express sympathy towards you, but no one cares about you. And I don't mean that in a bad way. I just mean that people just, they, they we like to say, oh, you're going through that. Oh, that's so hard. Oh, or they would say, oh, that's so good. 
you're you're such a good fighter you you never give up but at the end of the day you have to deal with your own things you have to deal with your own problem and we talked about it in the adinsaya uh, uh, show this person started a organization it's not even a company i cannot call it a company an organization seems more like a foundation that sells coffee in a capitalistic system but everything is doing everything he's saying relates more to a socialistic it, it has more socialistic um, values and principles there are certain socialistic countries that are perfect for that business model. Venezuela is the first one that comes to mind. <laughs> if, you, if you do that in the United States, <laughs> everyone... Oh, no. Yeah, it's <laughs> wrong a, one. Did it wrong? Yeah. <laughs> if you do it <laughs> in the United States... <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. If you do that in the United States or in any in, the, in Canada or any other capitalistic country, you're basically setting yourself up for failure. This guy is trying to. It seems like I don't know if you see it like that, but it seems like he's trying to use his personality, maybe his like ability to get to convince people to like him, so they would buy for from him would that be a fair assessment because every, mm -hmm. all his an his answers aren't factual it, it doesn't he doesn't say anything about the ambiance he doesn't say anything about the quality of the coffee he just talks about, it's a block kr it's called <laughs> feq <laughs> it's called it's called <laughs> <laughs> it's called are you better write, write the blog is if, if you have a crazy if you have a crazy business model you have to explain why you have a crazy business model right so it, but it, you understand what I'm saying? He yes, has a block. I understand block. what you're saying, but the thing is this. So I do think I understand what he's trying to say. And I think you hit it earlier on the head. Some people want to just stay down. So he, he classifies himself as cis, white, gender, man, queer man as well. He also says, clearly... Uh, that um, he's privileged. So he's trying to remove the privilege. It's, it's like it's like when, when you bait yourself in, in something else to remove the privilege. It seems like what he's doing right now. So basically he's trying to remove all the privilege and putting himself in a disadvantaged situation. That's what I think it it seems like it. So because he said he also says, however, this I'm, 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 let me share it. Continue. However, this opportunity was offered to me, and I see it as an opportunity to use my privilege uh, privileged position to undermine the system that put me here, to put me there. The best thing I can do is hire people who aren't white, cisgender, heterosexual men. Make them equal owners. Oh my god! And follow their lead in making the place less white male centered than the industry standard. That's what I'm working towards, <laughs> and I expect to be held accountable if I don't get there. Well, you know, boy, <laughs> boy, I, I, I have, I have a. Uh, how do they say that? I have a bridge to sell you, or something like that. <laughs> yeah, I have a. I have a, a bridge in Brooklyn to sell. Well, well I have. I, well, I, I'm taking it further. I have Eiffel Tower to sell you. <laughs> oh. You will never get there, boy. But well, let, I mean, so like I said, it's it's okay. it's it's the it's the it's the male centered thing. It's the white male centered. How do you say that? The 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 guilt, white guilt. But, He's trying but, to be uh, a, a, a sympathetic with his white guilt. Yeah, using the white guilt. But there's something else. Uh, again, I, I go back to his self-esteem. You can acknowledge that something is 
maybe not right or you can be of the opinion that something is not right but it shouldn't do anything to your self-esteem this person is is okay let me just give an example i'm a lawyer i'm proud that i'm proud to be a lawyer sometimes i talk to people who think that lawyers are scumbags and, and thieves and Aren't they all? No. I mean, I was going to say something. I was going to say something. But I mean, whether you believe it or not, let's say you believe it. And I can acknowledge that there are some lawyers who have been convicted for doing, you know, for, for wrongdoings. But that doesn't say anything about me. Because I know what type of person I am. So the fact that they did it doesn't mean that I have to feel bad about it. I don't have to apologize for what they did. That's the first thing. Second, second thing. As a lawyer, do you know what professions my... Uh, and I'm not doing... I haven't done a criminal law in a while. But you know what professions they exercise? Who? Cool. The, the, uh, the suspects. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I can tell you a couple. I've had. I'm going to save this for last. I've had. <laughs> <laughs> students. I've had. People who work in the hotel industry. Teachers. Uh, professionals such as. Uh, accountant and and a IT IT -er who basically were fraudulent or that's what no, the court no shop owners that's what the court said you know what you know what the the one i wanted to say for last is because i can go on a youth pastor guys <laughs> criminals and bad people come in different shapes and form so if you ha have an example let's say you and know color. Some, and color sorry but if you have an idea, if you think that it's not, maybe someone did something that's not right. A colleague, that doesn't mean anything. To, that doesn't, that should not affect my self-esteem. So I can acknowledge it. I can even acknowledge, for example, let's say if something happens time and time again in my industry, I can acknowledge that there's a, that there's something wrong or that, you know, the disciplinary committee need to act more need to act more rigidly or something but i cannot i shouldn't feel bad about myself and this person in his blog because that's what it is it's not an faq it's a blog he's basically trying to defend himself trying to 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 he's he's agreeing so he's showing that he doesn't even respect and love himself it saddens me to 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 say and the, the worst thing the worst thing to me is that it's written down, which means that he thought about it, then he wrote it, then he read it, and probably edited it to make it seem <laughs> more, to, to, to make it come over more um, martyr-like. It's, it's very sad. Yeah, man, I, I, I don't know where I have to take this one, but uh, I think, guys, let us know in the comments what you think about this business. Will it fail? 